Systems online. What's up guys, Admiral Styles here. Hope you guys are having a great day. For this video, we're doing a Federation vs Klingon fleet brawl. Well, I'm gonna say squadron brawl. These aren't full fleets. These are about six versus seven. All right, so really quickly, I'll go over the ships I'm using and then I'll start the match and I'll, I won't do any commentary during the match, but after the match, I'll do some commentary or do another battle, we'll see. All right, so we're using on our side the DN Ulysses. It's a dreadnought from the Tampiera. You might have seen this design from Star Trek Star Trek Command 1 and 2. It's never been on a show as far as I know, and I don't think it's ever been in Star Trek Online, but it's a pretty cool ship, I like it. And then of course we have two Constitution refits, and we have three Excelsior class ships. And then on their side we have three Emperor class battlecruisers, heavy battlecruisers, and then three D7s from the Enterprise era. But these D7s are balanced to be in line with the TMP era. I don't believe they were ever meant to be an Enterprise. But alright, these Emperors, you've probably seen these in Star Trek Klingon Academy. Red alert, shields up. Shield is draining, sir. Think there will ever be a chance for peace between the Romulans and the Federation? Captain, our attacks are draining their right shield. Sir, we are draining their top shield. Their aft shield is draining. Our forward shield is draining. Sir, their aft shield is draining. Our attacks are draining their right shield. Target hull integrity at 75%. Target hull integrity at 50%. Sir, they have hull breaches on multiple decks. Our forward shield is draining. Their bottom shield is draining, sir. Alright, so honestly I was not expecting for us to win. I did this battle a few times before and we got our asses kicked. So I don't know what changed this time, but yeah, the flagship is doing fine, minor damage to the hull, systems are fine. This one was the one that took the most damage, and it's fine as well. It'll be battle ready. It's battle ready as is. And then the three Excelsior class ships, they are fine. Just heavy shield damage, but 
Oh, this one has no damage. Interesting. Okay. Alright, so now I'll do a battle with me and the Constitution against Constitution Refit, just to be clear. Against one of those battle cruisers. Let's see how that goes. Red alert, shield up. Sir, we are draining their top shield. Shields are at 75%. Initiating scan. Bottom shield is draining, sir. Shields are at seventy five percent. Seventy five percent. Target hall integrity at fifty percent. Captain, their shield system has been disabled. Shields are at fifty percent. Target hull integrity at 50%. Integrity at fifty per cent. Target's hull has been breached, Captain. Shields are at fifty per cent. Target's hull has been breached, Captain. That's it. We got him. All right, guys, we beat the battle cruiser. That was fun. I like it when the AI actually uses the cloak properly. And in this case, it didn't quite work, but sometimes against that ship, it actually does work really well. Like, they'll cloak, and they won't decloak until they're right behind you with all their weapons firing at you, and then they'll cloak right back. It's pretty awesome when that happens. Alright guys, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you have any battle requests, drop it in the comment section. I have been getting a lot. I do have a list that I'm trying to work through, so just be patient. I'll get that out eventually. Anyway, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I will see you guys on the next one. Admiral Styles out.
I wouldn't be surprised if the Cardassians are responsible for the recent hostilities.